Cricket Australia CA has released more dates for its upcoming summer that now spans more than six months, reflecting an expanded Big Bash League BBL. The One Day Cup starts in Townsville on September 16, halfway through AFL and NRL finals. The Shield final begins the following year on March 28, with the second half of the first class season to start on February 23 because of a supersized BBL. March 28 is also the date Smith and Warner's one year bans for the roles in the Cape Town cheating scandal end. Steve Smith and Vice Captain David Warner were hit with 12 month bans for the roles in the Cape Town cheating scandal source. Getty Images if NSW reached the Shield final, the duo, who have vowed to play grade cricket in Sydney and continued to be wooed by 2020 leagues around the world, including South Africa, could technically be picked by state selectors. Duke's balls will again be used in the second half of the Shield season, meaning Smith and Warner would have a chance to practice with the pills they'll encounter if selected for next year's Ashes Tour. There will be no day-night Shield fixtures in 2018-19, Australia v England twin tons not enough to stop rampaging Poms Finch proves madness of Aussie batting order experiments Chief Smith led NSW to the Sheffield. Shield in 2014, Source, Getty Images Australia's four test series against India starts on December 6 but the tourists refuse to play the series opener at Adelaide Oval with anything but a red ball. However a two test series involving Australia and Sri Lanka will begin with a pink ball clash at the Gabba on January 24, test stars will either be playing an OD series against India, BBL a grade cricket in the lead up to that first test against Sri Lanka. For the moment Australia's first test against India finishes, players outside the 11 will be restricted to white ball action as they seek to build a compelling case for a baggy green. Roy's Relay Brilliant 040 The upside for the likes of Glenn Maxwell and Ashton Agar, both yet to play a test on home soil, is there will be five shield rounds before that first test. It is a luxury players haven't been afforded in recent years, even before an Asher series. The downside for Maxwell, Agar and many others in the mix to be part of the Test 11 is they almost certainly won't play all five. Two rounds overlap with limited overs action in Australia between Justin Langer's team and South Africa. Glenn Maxwell could get up to five Sheffield Shield matches to push his case for Test selection but he'll likely to be on one day duty. Source AFP The first two Shield rounds start on October 16th and 25 respectively. Australia is slated to face Pakistan in the United Arab Emirates until late October but dates for those tests and T20s are yet to be announced. The One Day Cup will revert to a six-state competition, with the CA11 no longer taking part. All six teams will be involved in knockout fixtures ahead of an October 10th final at Junction Oval in Melbourne. The latest sports news, in your inbox daily.